Hey guys and welcome back to my channel Lesson 8. So in this video I'm going to show you guys how to square any consecutive numbers. So first let's get started with an example. So the first example we've got here is 27 times 28. So there are two ways of doing this question. We're going to look at the first way which is by using the smaller number out of the pair which is 27. So 27 we're going to square the smaller number so 27 squared. So write the 27 squared and then we're going to add this to the 27 itself, so 27 squared plus 27. So first we have to work out 27 squared, so 27 squared, um, 4, 49, and then uh, 14, 28, give it up, 9, 12, 7. So 27 squared is 729. If you guys are wondering how I worked that out, well, I've got a video on how to square any number, so go check that video out, okay? So We've got 729 now. So we, now we have to add this to the plus 27. So 729 plus 27 is going to be 756. So we know that 27 times 28 is 756. So we, we've worked the answer out using the first method. Now let's have a look at the second method. So now we are going to use the larger number out of the pair. So Firstly, let's draw a line in the middle so we don't get confused. Okay, so the larger number in this pair is 28. So now we're going to square the 28, 28 squared. This time, we're going to do minus 28 because it's a larger number. Here, we did plus 27 because it's the smaller number. Minus 28 because larger number. Okay, so 28 squared. Again, so go check that video out if you guys don't know how to do 28 squared quickly. So that video will help you and the links in the description below okay so 28 squared 64 4 and then 16 32 4 8 7 so we know that 28 squared is 784 now we have to do minus 28 784 minus 28 it's going to be 756 so as you guys can see we can use this method using both ways. You guys can see which method you find the easiest and use that method. It's completely up to your choice. You can either use 27 or the smaller number, or you can use the larger number. Whichever you find the easiest, use that method. Okay, so now let's go on to our next example. So next example is 45 times 46, guys. So with this, I'm going to work out the smaller number, and you guys are going to work out the larger number, okay? So pause the video and work out the large number. I'm going to work out the smaller number in this case. Okay, so smaller number, 45. Okay, so we have, we're first going to do 45 squared. And then we have to add this to the smaller number, 45, plus 45. So 45 squared plus 45. So first, let's work out 45 squared. 45 squared is 20, 25. So 45 squared is 2025. And then we're going to add this to 45. And if you guys are wondering how I did, 45 squared that quickly well 45 squared I've got another I got another video on how to square numbers that end in five so go check that video as well and the link is in the description below so don't forget so 225 2025 plus 45 is going to be 2070 so that's the answer for 45 times 46 so well done guys if you guys got that one right and well done for attempting the larger number this time well, next time, I'm going to do the larger number and you guys will do the smaller number. And don't worry if you didn't get this one right yet. So the next one is 85 times 86. So with this, I'm going to use, I'm going to work it out using the larger number this time. You guys can work it out using the smaller number. Okay, so let's go. So larger number, 86 squared minus 86. Okay, so 86 squared, 64, 36. And then it's itself 48, 96, so 96, and then add this up, 6, 9, 3, 7, so 7, 3, 9, 6 is 86 squared, so we know that now. And again, the link is in the description below, so go check that out. So now we have to do minus 86, which is pretty simple, which is going to be 7, 3, 1, 0. So 85 times 86 is 7310. I hope you guys got that one right using the smaller number this time. But that's it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope you guys found this video useful. 
And if you did, give this video a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And if you want to see more videos like this, subscribe to our channel. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching.